ceramic coin. Oh, one of my nails came off. Oh my gosh, that's fun. <laughs> It is um, early in the morning. Um, I don't care though. Uh, but uh, yesterday I went to New York Comic Con and I got quite a few things. Not like a lot, but I got some things. So if you can't already tell, I got I got this. Um, it was like thirty dollars. I'm not exactly sure how they got them or why they had them, but they had like a giant stack of the. Bark, Nuru, and Pollen, um, and, um, it was really cool, um, the part why I bought them was because, like, on eBay, they're, like, insane amounts of money, um, but that was, like, the first thing I got, I think, um, and then for the second thing, I got this little guy, um, he was eight dollars, uh, but he's cute and I love him. And um, I I I went on Discord and showed a bunch of people this, and they asked me what I was gonna name it. And I usually don't name stuff animals, so I was like, uh, you can just name it. I don't know what else to name it, so I'll have to double check. But I'm pretty sure. We named like the, the big one uh, wolf and then this little guy Ren or vice versa. So it's Wolf Ren basically. Um, and if you don't understand the reference, um, I'll show an image on the screen. That's why I ship Wolf Ren. So yeah. But this guy's really cute and I guess could be like a keychain or something. I don't know. But I'm not going to do that or risk losing him or getting him dirty. So yeah. And then I got this, uh, wallet thingy, um, it's got, like, two compartments, and both of them have extra, like, pockets and stuff, it's really neat, and it, it came with an extra one of these, I'm not sure if that was, like, an accident, or if, like, that's, like, on purpose, I don't know, but it, there were, like, multiple different colors, but I just got this one, it was, like, $15, um, I definitely don't need another wallet, but also this was really cute and I loved it. And despite its um, size, it definitely looks like it can fit quite a bit. So yeah, this one's really nice. And then um, I got this. It was $60. Um, Kind of chaotic, I know, but there's a lot in there. So I've already opened it, but... um. Most of the stuff is still in here. I took out one of the things and it's in my bag right now, but I'm gonna open this up and show you guys what's in here. Okay, so, um, here we go. Ah, uh, heck. Eh! Okay, so this kind of has like, what is in it? Um, and then this is, I guess, I don't know what we got it from. I'm not entirely sure. Um, but so it came with a poster, a season four poster. So this is probably a bit older of a version. Um, hence this guy. Yes, there is a giant vinyl figure of Shadow Moth. I'm not sure who wants that or who decided that it should go in this box, but I mean whatever um it's probably gonna go in my collection i'm not sure if i'm gonna keep it in the box or not um i just keep more of the action figures and vinyl figures and whatever the hex in my collection shelf so yeah um and then it came with a temporary tattoo which was also nice but i'm probably never gonna use it um <laughs> uh it had conveniently it had a lanyard um which is also cool um yeah it was nice um probably i might open it i don't know um 
I mean, I'll open it at some point, but like, just, I don't know yet is a good idea. Then it came with this gigantic shirt. Like, it's an adult extra large, which is technically a little too big for me. This pattern thing is the back of the shirt. Um, so yeah, it's one of those shirts that has like the little logo on the front and in the corner and then the giant thing on the back, which it's a nice shirt. I'm not sure when I'm gonna wear this. I'm gonna find some use for it, of course, because this box was freaking expensive. Um, and then it also came with earbuds. Um, I'm not exactly sure. I think they're in my bag, but I'd have to dig them up. Okay, these guys. Um, I haven't tested them out yet because this little adapter thing doesn't work with my phone. I have to get the little piece to, um, like, make it go with my phone. Um, I have it. I own the little piece, but yeah. No. Anyways, um, it also came with a ceramic coin bank of the Miracle Box, uh, which I have not opened. Let me just move this over here. Oh my gosh, I'm trying not to break anything. Oh my goodness. Um, but yeah, it's basically just a ceramic coin. Oh, one of my nails came off. Oh my gosh, that's fun. It's a fake nail, don't worry. Um, uh, but... Um, let's see. Oh, wow. They were, like, not lying when they said ceramic coin bank. I'm not sure why they would give this to a child. I mean, I'm pretty sure they do that anyways. Um, okay, I need to figure out how to get this out of the box. Okay, it's out. Um, yeah, it's definitely ceramic. <laughs> um, I can see why they put it in, um the foam thing but we got all the miraculouses uh not sure why they didn't end up putting the camera i guess on the top maybe there just wasn't enough because the design uh what the heck um i mean i don't know it's all pretty cool i like it honestly it's really nice um it's really cool i like it um uh but yeah, there's the Peacock Miraculous, my favorite thing ever, I know, I know, it's crazy. Um, but then, of course, at the bottom, the little thing you use to, I guess, open it up. Um, usually, I don't like having coins, but what I'm probably going to do is I'm just going to use these, put coins in them, and save up for years or whatever, and, you know, decide what to do with this. So, yeah, um... I think that's pretty much what I got, but I did also get, um, a picture signed by, uh, the girl who plays Luz in the Owl House. I'm not sure what her name is. I know her first name is Sarah, but I forget what her last name is. Oh my gosh, I- unless I got her first name wrong too. Oh my gosh, I'm going crazy, but I'm really tired, so. Um, anyways, um- but yeah, that's basically what I got at New York Comic Con, if I'm not forgetting anything. I don't think I am. I think that's everything I got. Um, but yeah. Um, yeah, that's it, and thanks for watching.